Hi there and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 2. I'm Baron. Alright, let's go to the Temple of Loth and visit the Matron Mother. Very well. I hope this is not a sign of things to come. We must strive to maintain balance. Minsk is stupid again. Done. So. Ah, here you are, Matron. This is the mayor that I spoke to you of, Veldren. I can see him well enough, fool girl. You think I am blind? Eh, I see nothing special about him. What fascinates you so? Matron, he is an excellent fighter. And he is the one that would house the spanner of its other problem. This is the one? Illithids, Iterans, Gnomes and the mighty Solar Fine, are you sure? To me it looks scrawny and there is something odd. I am positive, Matron, that he could prove of great use to you. Eh, perhaps. Let him prove it then, if he is to become so favorite in the eyes of Despana. You, boy, you there, Veldrin, is it? Pay attention. The eye tyrant you killed coming from their so-called city. It was not the right type. I told the girl here which type I required and that was not the one. But Matron, I... Silence, girl. I will not swallow your lies. Speak again and I'll send you into the pits of Loth. Would you like to deal with the Drider again so soon, girl? Now, Veldrin, you have proven yourself as competent. This is good, House Hispana needs competence, a rare commodity when one is surrounded by fools. House Hispana is about to embark on a path to greatness, Veldrin. You can't, can't tie yourself tightly to us. Mother Loth approves of the successful. But I acquire something rather, something rare to begin this path. You might acquire it from me. So I shall give you the task and see if you can earn this partner's favor. I need the blood of one of the neighbor races, Veldrin. The noble races only and the blood from one of their most powerful members. A dangerous task. Your first option is to acquire the blood of an elder orb, most powerful of the Iterans. Its blood or its eye. I paid the fool girl to do it, but she failed. The spell jammer tyrant was supposed to be an elder, no it was just a beholder. Matron, I swear that it that is what the spies had reported. They must have execrated. Silence! You should have checked it on yourself, girl. Do you realize solely on this mail to be your strength and your wits? No, Matron, I do not. Enough. Should you go after the elder ops, you will no doubt find one in their tunnels in the southeastern portion of the main caverns. Your other option Options are to gather blood from the elder brain of the Illithid or from a prince of the Kuo Toa. Either would be as difficult as the elder orb. Well, as chance would have it, I have all three. The elder brain is guarded in the Illithid city through the southeast caverns. An old ruin of the Kuo Toa lies in the western caves ruled by a mad prince. Go then, Vernon. Bring me the blood of one of these creatures. How is this Bana awaits your return, but do not tarry. This is my command. Oh well, what shall we give him? Here, um. I actually collected some of the blood from the Elder Brain when I was at the Illithid city earlier. Will this do? You... you have already? Yes, yes you have. You have attuned my magic to sense this. I have attuned my magic to sense this blood, but I did not think to look for it on you. You have the blood, you have done it. Outstanding, Veldrin. Ah, the Spider Queen smiles upon us. Our gamble does not go unwasted, daughter. Your champion has brought us the blood that we need. And we lose all three, apparently. Praise Loth, the ritual may finally have begun. May finally be begun. This banner will Ruth 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 This banner will rule Ustnatha without question as the preeminent house. Indeed, but we must be cautious, daughter. Ever cautious. The ritual may be disturbed before it is complete. The silver one may get desperate. You are going to seal the city, matron? Yes, we cannot be disturbed from the outside. I shall go now and begin the proper 
preparations. This shall be a glorious day indeed. Veldrin, you have done House Despana the greatest of services. You will be a male without equal. Riches and slaves shall be yours. I shall see to it as soon as the ritual has been completed. Now is the time for you to rest, strong one. There is nothing more for you to prove to me. Well, I am not done with him just yet. Veldrin, come to my personal apartment. I expect to meet you there within the hour. This is not a request. Okay. So we have to go to ferry again. That was, um, I think, he and the female fighter society. All right. As you ask. The path to supremacy for a male lies either in the bedchamber or the books of the majors. Hold, friends. I have heard of your prowess as of late. Perhaps you will have interest in a business proposal of mine? Who are you? I'm Visaj. Visaj, yes. A merchant of some note within the city. Although you will not have heard of me, no doubt, since you are newcomers. No matter. I notice you are well equipped with magic, among other things, so I have assumed you may be interested in purchasing an item I currently have in my possession. See this golden rope I have here? This is a relic of no small power. Yours for the buying, if this is of any interest to you, of course. That depends. What does this rope do? Well, what this gilded rope can do and what it can be used for are separate things. A bit of explanation is necessary in order for you to understand. Go on then. First, to add credibility to its value, you must know that the rope belonged to the infamous Jarlaxel until I stole it, that is. Do you know of whom I speak? Yes? Jarlaxel? No, I don't think I have heard of him. No? This is rather odd. I thought all Drew knew of the mercenary Jarlaxel. No matter. All that you need to know is that he has many potent magics in his possession. Or at least he did. This gilded rope once belonged to him, and for and from what I hear, he sorely missed it during his day in Ustnatha. Sad, really, but it's not my fault. Sad, but it's sad about it. As the story went, Jarlaxel came on a mission for the House Jelad, helping in a war against House Gilish. It was done in an orgy of blood to please even Lord. In the sacrifices that followed, though, the matron of Jelad refused to pay Jarlaxel, saying that the service rendered to the Spider Queen should be payment enough. According to the tales, Jarlax the Simple bowed and left, even as the gathered house mocked him and spread the story of his foolishness. What does this have to do with the rope? Jarlax enacted a plan of revenge. He planned on acquiring the wardstone that would allow him entrance into House Jelat so he could return their favor. But the wardstone was held by the ancient founder of Ustnatha, Derex, a powerful lich residing in the Mage Tower. The rope was to protect Jarlax from Derex's magic. Ah, I swapped the real rope with the fake, however. Jarlaxel's men were being imprisoned by the lich and the rope was laughed out of the city for the failure. This is the real rope, however. With it, you would be immune to Derex's power and could loot the mage tower as you pleased. Consider the possibilities. How do I know you aren't tr just trying to sell me another fake rope? I assure you it is real. The dvioma is obvious. See how it glows? And to be honest, if the rogue ever attempt, attempts to regain it, I'd rather not have it on me. So you think Jarlaxle might come looking for it? One can never be sure. If he does, you seem more capable of dealing with him than I. Use it quickly and dispose of it, and he may never know. Interesting, how much are you asking for it? Not much at all. A mere 10,000 gold and it's yours. Um... Rather much. Well, okay, that's a fair price. Here you go. Excellent. That is a relief. You should be able to enter the mage tower and be safe, though I wouldn't attack D Rex if you can avoid it. Good luck, friend. Awesome. Oh, glory for the Dark Mother! You there, worthless male. Loth demands a service of you. Really? 
We have just crushed a sect of blasphemers. What? Gaunadar worshippers. But they have fled and now hold themselves against our vengeance. You will proceed to the southeastern corner of the city and eradicate them. We will allow no such heathen gods in the sight of lost children. Yes, mistress, immediately. You will speak when asked to speak. Go now and perform the will of Loth, she demands. How about you go and fuck yourselves? I'm so happy you brought me with That's you. probably here, but let's talk to Fairy first. Doing such great things. That's the right spot, right? Female Fighter Society, yeah. So there she is. It shall be. Veldrin? Good. I have a plan. A plan that will place me as the head of House Despana, even as we take our place as the rightful ruling House of Ustnatha. My plan includes you, Veldrin. Without your timely arrival here, none of this would have been possible. Do as I say, and your rewards will be unimaginable. Refuse and, well, why would you refuse? You have everything to gain, Veldrin. Everything. In order for this plan to succeed, however, we must betray the matron mother. Are you willing to do this? Think carefully on your answer. I would prefer to know first exactly what I'll be doing. No, there are too many things that cannot be said without your agreement first. I will hear it from your lips. Very well, I will, bet I will betray the matron mother as you ask. Good. Then you may aid me in my plan and be rewarded accordingly once I am the new matron mother. If you help the matron speak of a ritual, matron will summon a demon of terrible power, Valdrin. One to aid the draw in our attack upon the surface elves. So, a war? Open battle between the drow and the surface has not occurred in eons. With a greater demon to back them, I truly wonder why Renicus would do this. The blood is a component in this ritual, used to draw the demon's attention and bring him before us. But most gloriously, House Spana has acquired the axe of a silver dragon, the one guarding the route to the surface that we draw descended from so long ago. Holding these eggs hostage keeps the silver dragon from interfering. Even better, Matron plans to use them as an offering to the demon to enlist its aid. Indeed, what demon could refuse? House Despana will have opened the way for the war and summoned its most powerful warrior. We shall become preeminent. But there is no rule that states Ardulas must still be Matron mother of such a powerful house. Go to the treasury, Veldrin, steal the dragon's eggs and replace them with the convincing fakes that I have made that I have had made. You will then bring the real eggs to me. Matron will offer the fake eggs to the demon and, be demon and be killed, then I shall offer him the real eggs. The ritual will be completed and I shall be matron mother. Here, here is the key to the treasury room and the fake eggs. Take them. Return with the real eggs before the ritual is ready to begin. I give you one warning. The guards will try and stop you in the treasury if they see you. Kill them only if you must. Use stealth, Veldrin. Now go. Alright, what did we get? We have the key, we have the fake axe, and who has the rope? You have a rope. A length of smooth golden rope braided into a miniature pair of shackles. Visachi said that the rope would protect you from the effects of the Lich D-Rex's magic. We shall see about that. So, there are some heathens somewhere, I have been told. Probably here. Consider it done. Maybe we should form up here instead. Ah, come, come on, don't be fucking stupid. Okay. Where Minsk goes, evil. Okay, let's see what we can get. Oh yes, what do we have here? A priest, another priest, and an Otyuk. Oh great. Jump on my sword when you can! Get up! Tom No, only you three. So I 
Oh wait, that priest is not Fall, dead yet. And is. Beat the earth. For right and honor. Good is on our side. Yo, 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 yo. Oh wait, who the hell are you? Um, that was Relona. Don't like him? He's dead. Go for the eyes, boo. Oh, the yeah. the hero has been slowed. Fall, creature, and speed the earth. Good is on our side this day. Okay, I guess we were victorious. Huh? Deceased. You could change your shield back. What do we I get? I your past? word. Flail plus three. Okay, um, would that handmaid now be pleased? <gasps> yeah, she's deceased, but that will go away. Why are you so slow, Jahira? That will not stand. I await your it is done. Heal yourself, that should eliminate. More more And now you can move again, right? Yes. It shall be. Are you happy now? You have performed the will of Loth and are worthy of another day of life. You are blessed in your continued existence. It was an honor to serve, thank you. Do not presume to speak to me. Loth calls upon you regardless of your honor. Go, you are of no more use to me now. How about you go and fuck yourself? Alright, so... Um, where was... there's the tower of the mage. This will be interesting. This will really be interesting. I am willing. And we go in here. Consider it done. Fuck you. Huh? How am I supposed to excuse me? How am I supposed to get in there then? I have the fucking I will road. do my best. Oh, hi. Apparently we have to fight him. This place will bah. be your tomb. More fleshlings to disturb me? What is ah, you have the twisted cord in your possession. Well, it shall do you no good, fool. What are you doing, man?
Where? Oh. The knife is working apparently. A dangerous mistake. Oh great. Um What now? Uh, something went wrong here, right? The best surfacer is a dead surfacer! Ah, it will. Oh. So we got 22,000 XP for killing the Lich, but I am not sure whether it's supposed to be like that. Ah, it worked. I wasn't sure it would. These things have a way of never working out exactly as you plan. Thinking on the fly is an occupational hazard, and we actually meet Jarlaxel. I see. You must be the rogue Jarlaxel that was mentioned to us, yes? The one and the same. Charmed, I'm sure, pretty lady. Jarlaxel? Then Visachi lied. The rope didn't work. Lied? Now that is a rather harsh language, Visachi. Visachi, are you about? The path to supremacy for a mayor I am here, Commander, at your service. Or the books of the yes, majors. I see that. Allow me to introduce my lieutenant, Visachi. Visachi, I'm sure you are already familiar with Vel Veldrin, yes? Tell me, did you lie to him? I did not, Commander. I didn't think so. Visachi said the room would rope would protect you from Darex's imprisonments, but and it did. You are here, and not in some minuscule hellish subplane. This is a pocket plane, headquarters of the Bregan Deathy, my mercenary band. I hope this rope would bring you here, and I see that it has. Welcome, Veldrin. Um, uh, you wanted me to come here? Why? I wanted to see if you would actually attempt to face the Lich. Call it a test of your courage, if you will. With most of my men imprisoned by the Lich, I've hardly anyone left to do what I require done, and I can't go asking just anybody now, can I? And just what do you require done? Well, you were about to deal with the Lich anyway before I cast you into the plains. I simply need you to acquire something that he has in his possession. The Havard Stone for the House of Jeliad? No, 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 no. Even I know when to give up on a plan. My men come first. The Lich has numerous gems that contain the souls of my men and I want them back. Whether you kill the Lich or not, not is up to you. Killing him would allow you to loot the tower, I suppose. But however you get those gems is of no concern to me. Once you gather up the gems, I will use the rope to pull you back into the headquarters here. Easy enough, yes? You are ready to go then? Mm, what? Wait a minute. What do I get out of all of this? What do I get out all of out of all this? All right. We're at the gesticulating helplessly part, aren't we? Visachi, I thought I told you to remind me when we arrived at this point. My apologies, Commander, an oversight on my part. You're forgiven. As for you, my dear friends, I think you will want to do this. You wouldn't want your true identity revealed, would you, Hey, Chablomi? Ah, there's no need for such glare, Hey, Chablomi. I am confident you will acquire the gems and such action will be unnecessary. And if you kill D-Rex, you have access to his tower. You could even take the Gilead Wardstone and Pillage House Gilead if you wish. It's all good. I just want to make sure that you find those gems in a timely manner. How long would you say would be fair, Visachi? An hour? Perhaps a day, Commander. We are in no rush. Right. Hey, which told me won't need it, ja but just to be sure, you have one day, hey, which blow me to get my gems. Make sure you hold onto the rope. You'll need it. See you then, and oh, give my warmest regards to the Lich, who is dead already. Um, can we go yes. in here again? Wait. He's Very well. still there, yes? We have a wardstone and the lich's tooth. What am I supposed to do with the tooth? Oh, great. It will open the vault. I hope he didn't trap his own house.
done. There's nothing to get here. Okay. Oh great. I yep. thought the tooth would open everything. Gotcha. I approve heartily of the path that has been taken so far. The good has been upheld. I'm so I guess happy there's you brought yeah. you out. I never imagined ah, that we'd it. be there doing is a such trap. great things. Good to go. Well, a good thing that I somehow evaded it. What did we get here? Studded leather. Armor of the Viper plus 5. This armor's namesake is a serpent only in matter, referring to the drow assassin Raroth. Poison was his trademark, and when he discovered this suits suspectably to Venom, he gifted it to Evlorm, a promising novice assassin within his own guild. When Evlorm's power eventually threatened his own, Raro easily dispatched him, thanks to the weakness and ar of the armor he still wore. Minus two penalty to all saves versus poison paras paralyzation. So I guess you could use that, but then your spells would go away. So she doesn't seem to find a trap here. It shall be. Right you are. Consider it done. There's one of one of the gems. I'm leaving that in there. This will be the last one I take. Spook, wizard eye, glitter dust, deafness, limited wish, maps, minute metro. Well, hmm? and a few more spells. Nobody needs that, at least not to scribe it. Okay. So, one stone remains in here. Keep that in mind. I guess that's all we can do here. Because when we have all the stones, we will get teleported back. And I want to get teleported back once I have completed looting the tower. I await your word. Yeah, get the fuck in then. It shall be. All right, all right. We're still looking, trying to find traps. That's good. You point. Live by the sword. Live a good long time. Okay, there's not much to get here. Apparently, there's another door here though. Can't get to that spot. Apparently not. Consider it done. Oh great. That... I don't know what that does. All the gems go to you. Wand of magic missiles. Crossbow of affliction plus four. A devastating weapon. This crossbow unfortunately draws its power directly from the wielder. Some bowmen have used it regardless and many to great effect, but the drawback must be carefully considered. Its 
most famous owner, Gul de Lyon, made good use of it, fighting bandits in remote areas of Ferron, but he ultimately fell when he lacked the strength to defend against a rare assailant that got within striking distance. Yeah, minus two to strength. Two hundred sword plus two. Wand of frost. Short sword plus two. Spear plus three. Keiko fiend. What does the ring do? Ring of clumsiness. Okay, I guess we got it all. And that, well, appears to be an area that is inaccessible. Cities always teem with evil and decay. I will do my best. Let's give it a good shake and see That's what. So both. Uh, yes. That. You know. I approve heartily. The, of the entrances are on separate so levels of the, the tower. Has been upheld. But on one level here. That's weird. Okay. Very well. Ah, fuck it, get in. Alright. So I guess all that is left for me to Done. do is to take those gems here. Or were they in there? I don't really remember. Yeah, that's it. And here you are once again with gems in hand. Really, hey, Bridget Bilby, you have lived up to my expectations and then some. I'll take those gems. Thank you. Ah, uh, precious, aren't they? To think that Jeliad have acquired, have squirreled away such beauty for a millennia. What do you figure they get on the market, Visanji? A considerable amount, Commander. There are more than a few nobles who would pay dearly for the opportunity to vex the Jeliad, regardless of their worth. True enough. I wish I could be there to see the matron mother's face when she finds out we got our payment anyway. But but I thought you said the lich trapped the souls of your men in those gems. Would I risk my man against the lich? I just wanted the payment I was due, as well as collecting the price of the matron mother's insult to the Bregan Delthy. I have not only collected the soul gems of the mother matron who founded the Jeliad, but you killed their ally Drex, a member of their own house. I think matters between the Bregan Diethi and House Jelad are pretty much even now. Wouldn't you agree, hey, would you blow me? Hmm, fine, you've gotten what you wanted, now send us back. Ah, you are a good spot, hey, would you blow me for a surface elf? I do not know what you... I do not know what you are doing in Ustnatha, but I'll allow you your secret. Do as you wish I cannot. I would like my robe back now, so I shall relieve you of it. A bit of gold, my friend, for your trouble. As for what you choose to make of your encounter with me, it's up to you. You may choose to be bitter, or you can take advantage of your situation. D-Rex is dead. Loot his tower before the mages of Sorcery close it up with magic. You can use the Gilead Wardstone to enter and loot their house as well. If you do, I will ensure that the Jeliad cannot alert the rest of the city, and if you kill the matron and ruin her house forever, it would serve her right. Hmm, I'll take that into consideration. Time for you to return to Ustnatha then. You've been quite a sport, hey, would you blow me? Perhaps we shall meet again. Alright, so we can loot another house of the drow. That shall be interesting. Where is it? 
House Gelat is here. So we form up here. As you ask. Did we get 10,000 XP? That's okay. Probably some money too. We shall see. Yeah, we could have fought him, but he is not really evil, so I don't think we have to. He's more the charming rogue, rogue kind of guy. Okay, so we will take a break here and continue the next video. So thank you very much for watching and see you soon. Bye.